Mr. Fajar had a piece of paper measuring 30 cm by 21 cm. So remember, paper, we only have what? Length and breadth. So you can see, this is the length. This is the breadth. Okay? Next, they tell you that he cut out a square of sides 5 cm at each of the four corners, which they show you here. This is the square. All of them are the same. 5 cm, 5 cm, 5 cm. All cut out from the four corners. Okay? So you can see, uh, just to highlight to show you all, this is the remaining part after he cut. Okay? This is the remaining part after he cut. Right? Then, you see what they say in the next slide. He folded the sides up. What are the sides that he's going to fold up? Okay, what we'll do is, this part, right? He will fold up. Understand? This part, fold up. This part, fold up. For all this dotted one that I'm doing, you can see that it fold up. Okay? So after folding up, what he did is he take the corner to form an open box as shown over here. Understand? Okay? He fold all this, then he take this side together, right? These two parts tape it together, you get here. Okay? Okay. Part A, you're supposed to find the volume of this box. So if you find volume, what's the formula? Length the first time high. Okay. So what is my length here? This small one is 30, right? This side I cut away means uh, minus 5. This side I cut away means minus 5. So in terms of the length of the box, 30 minus 5 minus 5, you get 20. Then, of course, the same thing, right? How do I find this now? This one is where? Is this part, right? So the whole thing is at 31. Minus 5 minus 5. So for the breadth, okay? Now this. The height. What is the height? Height is this part here. What did I say? How do we get this corner here? This part is where these two so-called stick together, right? So this part, how long is this? Five. So the height is just a five. Okay, I put it down. This one no need to calculate because it's there, but at least we put it down. Okay? So now with the length graph height, can you find your volume? Yes. Alright, so for the volume,
only be doing this kind of question. Physically, the whole cube, 100 of it. 